In this video, I am going to block Wilson as a contact in my WhatsApp, both to show you how it's done, but also to show you what Wilson sees once he's been blocked. So let's get started. Here I am in a chat session with Wilson. There are two ways I can block Wilson from contacting me. And since I'm already in the chat screen, the easiest way is to click on his name at the top of the screen to open up his contact information. There at the bottom of the page is the option to block contact. Clicking the option confirms that blocked contact will no longer be able to call or send messages to you. The other way to block contact is to open settings by clicking the icon in the bottom right of the screen. Choose privacy from the settings menu and there you will see an option called blocked. This option lists all the contacts you have blocked and here you can add additional people to that list. You'll see I get a notification in the chat screen confirming that Wilson is now blocked. However, Wilson does not see the same notification on his screen, albeit he is still able to access our chat history. If I try and send a message to Wilson he, whilst he is blocked, WhatsApp tells me I must first unblock his account before the message is sent. If Wilson tries to send me a message, the message simply fails to get delivered and Wilson still has no idea that I'm blocking him. Similarly, if Wilson tries to call me, the call will go unanswered. As you can see, I have no awareness that Wilson is trying to call and for Wilson, the call simply rings out. No messages of any kind can be sent to or received from Wilson. If I update my status, you'll see I receive an error that the update could not be sent since Wilson is my only contact and he is no longer allowed to receive my status updates. Everyone else will see the updates as per normal. Likewise, if Wilson updates his status, I also will not see his updates. If I decide to later unblock Wilson, any messages he's tried to send whilst he's been blocked will not be delivered to me. He will have to resend those. So that's it. When you block someone in WhatsApp, they don't appear to receive any notification that they have been blocked, except that when they try to send you a message, it will not be delivered. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you hitting the like button and hit subscribe for lots more quick tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.